life that begins in India with drones, the skies over India being full of drones. What are the defense issues here? Is India manufacturing drones? Is India more importantly manufacturing anti-drone systems? Because we are seeing attacks from across the line of control uh, using drones. Firstly, uh, drones have multiple applications, even in defense and security related, lots of applications from the drones. Today in the country, there are lots of startups which have come in the area of drones and which we are encouraging them, supporting them and providing all uh, hand-holding to come out with multiple drones for varieties of applications, whether it's for the normal applications in the normal planes or for the high altitudes or for the load carrying capabilities or for the surveillance applications or for anti-drone applications. As you know that we are one of the few countries who have come up with the uh, applications for countering the rogue drones. They have been uh, deployed, the technology has been transferred to multiple industries and they are producing them now, the anti-drone applications. Also in the uh, drone applications for surveillance, for transportation of various things, lots of things are being done in the country. Number of industries are working uh, on this side and we are trying to provide all the support what is required for these uh, industries which are working on this, both on the drones which are required for the surveillance, transportation, many other applications and also on the anti-drone applications which various technologies which are required for this are being developed and trying to provide the technological support and technology transfers to various industries. I'm sure in the coming uh, months and years India is going to come up with many drone uh, applications and drones being developed in the country and I'm sure India will be leading the world in the drones. See, the te technologies to counter these rogue drones have already been developed and they have been transferred technology to industries and various uh, armed forces and security agencies are in touch with these industries to get them deployed at the sensitive locations.